Hello everybody, this is Old Scrunt, and we are on XCOM. Last time out we took out the alien beast, which was pretty fun. Um, well, it wasn't so much fun, it was it was a very long video. I hope you stuck around to watch the entire thing, if not I can understand. <laughs> um, yeah, so, um, this time round we have a... Second, I, I just need to double check something because I may have got a new squad member. No, nope. not yet. I haven't got a reply yet, so it'll be waiting till next episode now. Unfortunately. Right. So um, yeah. Anyway, last time out we did the alien base, and this time we're gonna just go ahead and find something to do. Yeah, sure, you can have that. We've got a large contact, and it's coming in fast. We're going to have a difficult time keeping up with this one. Going to have a difficult time taking it down with a Raven 4. Don't I have any more? No, I don't. I would have thought I would have had more... things. More Firestorms, but I don't. I could do at least one more. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to do much against that. I can attack it just to be threatening, but there's not really much else that's going to happen. Enemy is padlocked. Oh, what is that ship now? That's a um, abductor, or is it a supply barge? Tried his best. We have one here now. Could do we put infusion lances on this? We have eyes on the band. Because uh, the lasers are a bit dangerous to have on. Nearing strike range. Like, the lasers are pretty powerful, but they're a bit dangerous to use. Just because you have to move in close. It looks like we're going there. So, well, it's already put two of the squad members in there. Need to. Um, so this will not take as long to do. I still need to go out and find um, Simon's nickname if uh, there was one put down. It's all a matter of trying to remember which episode it ended up on. Right, so we've got two of these guys here already. Um, just got to remember who else is on this one. Sean's on this one. Oh wait, no, yeah he is. Um, yeah, Sean's on this squad. Don't know how I forgot that, but... I did. Um, I'm just going to save side. I'm just going to look at my list. Jordan Finch. And uh, David. I don't have enough for a second plasma sniper rifle, though, and yeah, fortunately, um, we end up with David having a laser instead of a plasma. It'll be okay. What the hell is going on with your armor? Right, I don't know. I'm just gonna leave it like that just because it looks kind of cool. Um, there we go. Um, next time we get a smaller, like get a medium UFO, I'm probably going to do the suicide mission. So um, if you can find that at the end of the video, then um, we'll send one of you lucky fellows on a suicide mission. You know, because it's lucky to be sent on a suicide mission. Yeah. Right, and then because last time out the shiv went out, 
I will send myself out. Probably could do a bring in another med kit. Right, there we go. Prepare for deployment, strike one. Listen up, we're going to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. It looks like the aliens went down in a sparsely populated area. If there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay clear. Why do I get the feeling we're going to bump into a sector pod? I just have this horrible feeling about it. Strike one is ready to secure the craft. Copy, big sky. Where am I on the ship? Oh, this is the actual end of the ship where you find the like captain of the ship. So we could just end this now and get the <laughs> sectoid commander or whatever. Roger, I've got my eyes on. Which would be nice to do. Get it out of the way already. I'm on it. Work our way through the ship backwards and take out everything else. Headed there now. Covering now. Heading to that location. On overwatch. Out. This is going to be interesting because we're going to be coming up behind them. Moving. Overwatch. Aye, aye. <laughs> Moving to position. So Sean is getting there first because he's got the um, arc thrower. So ideally, he needs to be in there. Well, closest to the enemy, anyway. Solid copy. Moving out. That should be two of these guys, so we'll have to do our best to make sure we take them out. Take at least one of them out. And capture the other. It depends if there are in here though, because I mean, we have ended up at this side of the ship first instead of the other end, so. For all I know, there might not even be any sector commanders, they might have died in the crash. One thing I could actually do to find out Roger that. is I could throw the battle scanner up there. Sweeping. Yep. Just as I thought. Heading to that location. Roger that. Scanning. So we should be able to get everyone in there ready to destroy hopefully heading there now eyes on the prize on the move we'll get Sean in there as well because he needs to capture one of them on overwatch and Jordan's lagging behind a bit but got it covered he'll be fine Roger that scanning <laughs> Right. 
Let's decide how we're going to do this. Which one's going to be the best one for Sean to get to? He can get to that one, and he can get to that one. But this one's more in the open, so... We'll get Sean set up ready for this one. That accuracy. The accuracy is amazing there, uh, Jordan, I must say. Free critical. Oh no, I killed it. Enemy destroyed. Killed it like some kind of idiot. Well, I have to get Sean ready to move up to this one then instead. Position confirmed. See, I didn't think I'd kill it, I didn't think I'd get a critical hit on it, but... Yeah. It didn't work out. I'm actually just really surprised that he decided to shoot at me instead of, um... Like, trying to mind control me. Location confirmed. I don't know what I'm actually doing here, but I'm working out as I go along. There you go. You're gonna be captured now. Heading out. Just make sure everyone's in cover, really. This turn. Oh no! Come on. He had to go for the one that. Had the arc thrower. Oh great! Look who's here. Could capture one of them instead. This is a pretty bad situation. They're flanking my position. It's not what I wanted. No, I don't want him to go, to go up there. Solid copy. We need to get here. Destroy this guy because he's a jerk. And then we'll um, work out everything else from here. Hmm, maybe I shouldn't use a rocket. That would probably be the worst move I can do at this point. There we go, another one down. X-ray neutralized. It'd be cool if we can capture one of these guys, but I'm not gonna hold my breath. I think they only give you um points like credits towards a um Like I think you only get research credits towards um the Archangel armor. Oh here we go. Grenade. You 
didn't even get access to his weapon that he's got, because he's got like a heavy plasma rifle instead of a um, regular one. Oh well, let's kill him. Or almost kill him. You know, why not? Let's just go and capture him. I'm on the move. Sleep tight. Not so tough now, are you? There's some fin men somewhere. I think I heard something. I don't understand why the music keeps going, even though, um. Uh, like, we just stunned the enemy that was in the room. It's one of those things that we didn't patch. I don't think they patched it in Enemy Within either, which is unfortunate. It's not game breaking, but it's just annoying. Alright, let's be speedy. Let's also heal up Jordan a bit. Good as new. I'll be happy when we get the uh, improved med kits. Safe side. Fin men. I didn't think they'd be there. I thought it'd be where they are now. It's fun to miss. I don't know what's up with Jordan's accuracy at all. Jordan's accuracy is insane. Like, compared to everybody else's. Alright, let's survive his turn, hopefully. Probably not because Finmen are absolute jerks when it comes to damage and accuracy. Even though they're only using light plasma rifles. Yeah, you squeal all you want. Let's deal with some of you guys now. <laughs> Do you see his plasma rifle just go flying out of that room? He just went. Vzzoo. away from Jordan because he's kind of dead if I stay right next to him. That is not good. Moving out. Kill them all. Scanning. 
kind of interesting that it didn't decide to move. Because, like, he's going to get killed. Right. So now we can revive Jordan here. I think I'm going to have to start equipping uh, Jordan with a scope. Just so we know he's got a better chance of hitting things. It's just okay. his accuracy is so low for some reason. And I'm not really sure why. Maybe he killed too many things with explosives or something. I don't even know if that's a thing on this game. I probably should know, but I don't. So we've got mutants to deal with still, from sounds of things. That wall just exploded. Yeah, Jordan. I don't know what the hell is happening. <laughs> Good as new. Try my best to keep you alive there. You hear that? That is not very good. Headed there now. That sounded like right next to us. I've got my eyes on. Get some people in these doors. Heading there now. Locked and loaded. Cause that was just right outside that noise of the mutant. Okay. Locked and loaded. There's something out there. Let's have a look. Well, straight away, one thing I can do, I can use the rockets to take these guys down a lot of hell. Okay, that was weird. The game went dodgy for a second. Okay. Oh, it might have been because that berserk was moving. Caleb's just got promotion. Um, let's go for that um, mute on down below, if we can. If not, I'll go on Overwatch. On Overwatch. That's affirmative. Right, I've got an idea here. <laughs> idea here. Um, need to turn my camera around. My idea is to chuck this down here and kill that other muton. Hopefully I've hit the right spot with it. Yep. Into the fiery goes. Sleep now in the fire. On the move. Um. Idea, idea. Okay. Bad move, Mr. Muton. Or Berserk, I should say. 
That's a miss. What more do you have to do to hit someone at that range? That was just stupid. Really? <laughs> I can feel his frustration there, Sean. <laughs> it's like he screams, SHOT WIDE! Oh, that was short. Okay. I was expecting a lot more of enemies spread out across the entire ship. That works. I definitely prefer that to um, going through the rest of it. Caleb's been promoted to Colonel. That's our second Colonel. Saviour. You could probably just get like an entire squad and just have them all have Sentinel and um, like hovering fire. Like just have everyone with it. Because I think there's that sort of option for every single um, class except for the sniper. Unfortunately, Jordan's gravely wounded for 16 Another days. Another capture? Please give my thanks to the main commander. I know it can't be. Yeah, for some reason, you only get a um, plasma rifle. You can trust that the research team will make it worth the trouble. You only get a plasma rifle from um, capturing a heavy float for some reason. But when um, when you kill him, it says heavy uh, plasma rifle exploded or something like that. It's really weird. Keeps back in action. Cyanic Labs available for construction. That'll be fun. Um, interrogate Heavy Floater. Oh, well, I'm not going to do that actually yet. I need to decide on some of these other things. Because some of these things are going to be more beneficial to us than others right now. and. I mean, we could go for the story option, but don't need that just yet. The alloy cannon and guided fusion launch would be nice, but at this rate, it's going to take a while anyway. Uh, cyber disk—I can't remember what you get for researching cyber disk. This is the thing I don't actually remember what you get for half of these things. I know you get if you get the sector pod, you can um get faster repairs and faster building. Cyber disk. Right, um we'll get the thing built when we can. The magical psionic labs. I'm not sure how much Santa Clubs cost though. Four hundred dollars credits. We don't have that much. I think even if we sell a list we won't have that much. Nope, we're still short. All the berserker corpses we got. Didn't know we had so many of them. Right now we have enough to start building it. So we'll build that and we'll get some people chucked in the um Sci Labs as quickly as we can, really. Hopefully get some psychic soldiers going. Scan for our next mission. Oh dear. Squad 2 seems to be getting all the terror missions at the moment. 
Okay, that's um, Squad 2's turn next time for to go out. And that's a terror mission. So, they're going to have fun doing that. So, guys, um, UFO tracking. Ah, that's what it was. Uh, hmm. Sectoid. Right, guys, so next time we'll go out and do that terror mission. So thank you for watching everybody and next time we might have a new recruit as well. So uh yeah, I'll see you guys later for some more XCOM.